When Meta released their Quest Pro last year, it received mixed reviews. While an impressive piece of hardware at $1,500, the software experience came up a little short. Now, I still need to give my full review of it, but there are a couple things holding me back, specifically with the Quest Workroom software, Horizon Workroom software, which allows you to create a virtual work environment for you or for your coworkers. One of its coolest features is the ability to map your desktop on this massive monitor that floats above your screen. This can be done both in a virtual environment or through pass-through mode as though it's floating in real life in front of you. With Max, you can do this with up to three screens in front of you at a time, but unfortunately on Windows, you can only map one monitor, or at least one monitor for every number of monitors that your computer already has. For most laptops, that's obviously just one. Now, there are a couple solutions for this. You can use other remote apps that might give you this experience, but might not have the same features as MetaQuest workrooms. You can also buy an external monitor like this, but that's expensive and bulky. So I had an idea. Maybe there's a way to virtually project screens in Windows with something even simpler. So for less than 10 bucks, I picked up a couple of these, little HDMI dongles that plug into the side of your laptop and, or desktop and make your computer think that another monitor is attached. Now normally this dongle is meant for Bitcoin miners, but thankfully we're not going to be doing that today. We're hoping it will allow us to have multiple screens set up in VR, even though we only have one screen on our laptop. So first, we'll go ahead and plug the HDMI dongle into the side of our laptop or through another dongle. And then we'll go into the Windows display settings. We'll select our displays and see that there are multiple displays connected. See, the second display currently is set as mirror and we'll set it to extend instead. We'll make sure the resolution it's set to is non-zero. Then we'll drop into the Quest headset and connect to the laptop as usual. And just like that, two monitors show up where there used to be only one. I tested it, and this seems to work with three monitors as well if you want to plug in multiple dongles. Now, obviously, I'd love for Meta to support this natively, but I'm glad for less than $10 I was able to fix this issue. For those of you with the Quest 2, not the Quest Pro, this will work as well. We'll leave a link down in the description to these little HDMI adapters if you want to buy some yourself. Be sure to keep an eye out on the channel for future videos, as, along with the full review of the MetaQuest Pro. Thank you for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.